<laughs> We're losing people. We're losing people in the line. <laughs> okay. So me and Nathaniel are heading off to Schaefer Trail. We're actually heading off to Muscle Man Arch. Um, they named it after the guy that um, found it, found it in 1965. And there's also a legend saying that if you cross it, pretty much you're like fearless. Cool. So what, what actually makes this trip pretty, you know, unique is that we're doing it in a 2004 Toyota Corolla with 197,368 thousand miles. <laughs> We're doing it in the, one of the cheapest cars you could possibly do this with. Bumpers about fall off, we're already messing a bumper, transmission. But we did say it was a Toyota Corolla, so we should it have- It has, uh, oil's been changed only once since I got this car, which was <laughs> two, almost a year ago, almost a year and a half ago. Spark plug's still the same. <laughs> Original spark plugs. We gotta just, if you wanna see a little bit of the car, it's pretty much an old college student car, basically. Not a student car, redneck car. Redneck car, I guess. Falling a redneck car. But anyway, we just wanna show that you're able to do a lot of adventures here in Moab, Utah, even if you don't have a big 4x4 or the truck or anything. As long as you have like a. Unless you guys are pussies. Hey! As long as you have a real a liable car, you should be awesome. Okay, that's it. We're gonna see if we make it.
<laughs> hey, if you didn't know what that just happened right there, we just passed up the Jeep. We just passed up the, a big old Rubicon. So that's the trip? Uh, like I said, pretty much anybody can do this trip. You don't need like some big expensive truck. And I mean, hey, don't get me wrong. That's really nice, but if you just have a regular car, you know, you can do it. It's not a big deal. I, I would make sure it's a Toyota just because it's reliable. You know, it might be a, a real bumpy ride, but at least you know it's going to get you out and you don't have to worry about that kind of stuff. So.